given my big up filter, the 200mm one, which is a 1m high, 200mm diameter, uh, which is about the same sort of size as a Tornado, uh, Tempest, sorry, <laughs> keep mixing them up, but uh, it's the same sort of size, so I'm putting some air in now, but I think I would like a bit more air and to agitate it a bit more than that, so I might try and come up with a using some 15 milli uh, plastic tube I think because at the minute I'm only using the standard uh, 4 milli 6 milli tube which isn't very big at all and it uh, doesn't look like it's agitating as much as I would like so that's at work and there it's been going for about maybe a week now yeah about a week now so that's something that bottom see what comes out eh? uh -oh. <laughs> I don't think it was big enough to see it at all. Not to worry. Still caught a fair bit of stuff there, as you can see. Uh, yeah, a fair bit of stuff. There's quite a lot of dirt in there for a week. And that's after you know, there was a drum that's done its work on it, so it's still taking extra stuff out, it's still taking fines out. And so that's even after the drum been on it which is about a 70 micron I think screen and so still working pretty well and doing a good job so I'm quite happy to leave it in there and we'll keep working on it ok here's a 200 mil up filter and as you can see it's got the new air on it so it should pump up quite a lot of air so let's switch it on let's see what happens Here, yeah. uh, we can finish the clean by taking off the top. Getting the hose in. Giving it a good clean down. Clean piece of media, pretty clean. Ready to trap again. All those fines that have now been taken out. Thanks to all you subscribers out there, all the old ones and the new ones. Please subscribe, ring that bell, and give us a thumbs up. Thanks for watching. See you later, guys.